Sebastian is back for a brand new YouTube video. In this video, I'm going to be doing an update on my driving license, on fitness, what I've been up to lately, what stress I've been facing lately, and generally how I'm generally doing, okay? So, it's another, <laughs> another video without my shirt, I don't know, it's like, these update videos I'm starting to do without my shirt on. It's probably like, because in Florida it's very, very fucking hot. Okay, very, very hot. So, it's like, <laughs> you know, it's already so hot out here. Like, you know, it's really hot. Like, American temperature, like it's in the 90 Fahrenheit and in Celsius, okay, it's like dirty and it dirties every day, you know, you have been tempted. So, yeah, we're gonna be doing an update on my driving license. <laughs> I passed my driving license. Holy fucking shit. Holy shit. I passed my driving license today. I cannot believe it. Like, look at this here. I passed it. For some reason, I can't show you the address, but like, you know. There it is, you see. Boom. Pass my driving license. Today, and gosh, I did my road test today, and I was like, oh my god, I passed it. <laughs> Holy fucking shit holy shit i passed my driving license <laughs> this is like one of the best things of my life like i had to, you know i had trouble getting in belgium and you know i don't want to go into too much details and stuff but you know it was because i don't i that i'm gonna explain in another video but it's just i passed it and i feel amazing like i get to drive on the world now like, I'm free, man. I have all the freedom... Freedom available to drive wherever the hell I want. Like, having a driver license, it's fucking great. It's fucking great. And... It, in Florida, it's so fucking easy to pass this test. If you pass the, the world test in Florida, you are a moron. Okay? You are a moron. It's so easy. It's so fucking easy, okay? All you need to do, listen. All you need to do on the world exam is do a three-point turn, park between some cones, stop at stop signs, accelerate 20 miles per hour, stop, and drive around a neighborhood and around the parking lot. And that's it, okay? It's so easy. It's so easy. So, the mistakes I did, okay, I did a few mistakes. And I'm going to tell you the mistakes I did so you avoid them. Number one is, I hit the curb when I did my three-point turn, okay? So, the curb is on the side of the world. And so, there I got some minus points. And I forgot to look left and right on every time I was at every side I was on three point turn okay so so for example let's say for example this is the world okay this is the world okay this is the world okay let's say here and here, okay? And let's say, look, here on the side is the curb, okay? There's like, uh, on the side of the road, okay? And what I did is, like, I looked here, before going to three-point turn, I looked here in both directions, okay? Then when I went here, usually you also need to look in both directions, okay? Because this thing goes here, and then you go this way, you see? And you come from this way. Three-point turn, one, two, three, okay? And I forgot to look here and there, and I touched the curb. So, that, there I got some minus points. Um, then I, 
I got some minus points talking um, because I wasn't completing the sentence so I got some minus points there but I didn't take, touch the cone because there are some stuff like if you touch the cone or knock down the cone or you don't stop at a stop sign like you will get disqualified okay had I been more on the three point and had I gone a little more I would have maybe gotten over minus 15 points okay in total you allowed 30, 30 minus negative points and I got 15 negative points but and still passed so that was that you know so that's just a driving license I mean you know I told you before I do a way more in-depth video on that you know how that wins etc okay so another update on my life let's go to the gym okay the gym so I I found a gym right near where I live here Florida and I've been really busting my ass in the gym lately like I like the other the other day I went five miles on a treadmill I it was lifting so much weight etc which I'll show you later how my body looks like and it was just great you know like working out again in the gym in a good setting and I really pushed myself and I remember when I woke up no pain no gain and I was thinking oh I really want to film for all of you in the gym but the thing is like I only have you know I don't have an editing software on my computer and <laughs> You know, I just, I don't have my editing software and I don't want to set up like a tripod in the, in the thing or have like people see me filming, it just becomes awkward, you know. And so that's that and maybe I should film an uncut video there, like a 20 minute video of me doing one exercise. And just comment below what you think I should do with the, the workout thing, you know. But it's like I really pushed myself hard very very hard in the gym like the the past few days i i worked out like one or two hours per day okay i see people going in running 30 minutes on a treadmill and going out like you know, me no it's for the long run okay if you want to become successful you need to do the boring work for the long run and enjoy the process enjoy the process for example when I, with my driving license, learning how to drive, getting my driving license, enjoy the process and know that it will pay off, okay? You need, really need to work your ass off here, okay? You need to cut out lots of distractions and work your ass off to achieve your goal. You're better than that. Don't be like 99% of the society um, doing this boring work, not wanting to do this extra mile. No, go and do the extra mile. Put an extra hour of work. Okay, when others give up in the gym, you continue, 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 continue. Push yourself to the max. And like, I feel amazing waking up. I'm very healthy. I like, I feel way more energy in me. And the gym is so addictive. So fucking addictive. Holy shit. Holy shit. Gym is really addictive. Like, <laughs> I, I can go one day without the gym. Like, if I go one day without a gym, like, I become, like, my brain becomes, like, weirded out. Like, I need to go to the gym, you know? It became, like, a habit, a lifestyle in me, you know? Um, so, yeah, gym is very addictive, and it's just nice working out, seeing the progress on your body, and looking back a few months, few years later to see a progress, you know? Lately, I've been seeing so much progress, like, my legs are getting stronger, and my, my chest, you know, way more muscles, like, I just feel way more better, you know. So, yeah, start working out, start working on your driving license, don't give up, just do your thing, you know. Don't care about losing friends, if you don't care, you know, don't, don't care about that, don't care what others think of you, just do something for you, you know. Give yourself more love and respect focus on you your mind and like be ready to do some slightly sacrifice so for example like when I was working on my driving license I made sure to only focus on that and no nothing else e everything else family friends going out it was all second priority you know it's like just you need to fix it on one thing you know and stay focused okay um, 
don't quit when you when you you feel oh shit everything's hopeless no don't quit that's where you do one more step one more step one more web one more hour of studying one more fucking hour of work remember that okay but you're gonna be settled in mediocrity and live a very very miserable life okay and i don't want you to do that okay if you do nothing you're gonna live a very miserable life okay you need to start working hard hard work pays off and it's very rewarding okay um so yeah that was that so i wanted to show you a progress on my workout um look at this here so basically i'm gonna put the tripod by the way this is gonna be an uncut video but 22 minutes long okay so if you don't want to watch just get off now okay so yeah putting my tripod on and then so yeah this is gonna be so so good so i'm gonna show you my my workout update i really really need my editing soft to back shoot <laughs> So today we are June 25th, 2019 I think, what are we 2019 or 2020? Come on Sebastian, you should know the day. 2019, I knew it wasn't 2020. So, 2020, okay, uh, 19. So, but let me show you my progress. So, this is my progress. See this here? See, looking good, you see. So, yeah. I feel strong and better, and my legs, like, look at that, like, they're becoming really muscular here. Like, it feels amazing. It feels amazing. So, that's on the workout, and it's like, I literally, like, you know, I put like a way a good tip to keep track on your workout is like you want to set a to-do list okay so you're gonna say okay i'm gonna run three, three miles on the treadmill you you take it you make a to-do list okay one three miles on the treadmill and you put a little x right nearby okay so once you uh one the three miles on the treadmill okay you are going to take it off Okay, I'm going to take it off. Um, one second, gotta have some orange juice here. And also, like the other ones, like you also would like to, you know, when you make a, when you say, okay, I'm gonna work out. Do that, 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 that in the gym. You want to make sure you do it and you take them off. Like, okay, bench press, 15 pounds, 15 times. Once you do that, okay, you check it off. Bench press, 5 pounds, 50 times. Once you do it, you check it off and it's like a, a checklist. And once you do that with a checklist, like, life would become way more easier in the gym, okay? So you want to do that and set high goals, okay? And put yourself in a situation where... I'm only allowed to go home once I do that workout, okay? I understand what I mean. But yeah, I'm gonna be um, telling that in a different video, okay? I'm scanning there. 
So you might be wondering how's my diet going. I have been focusing much on that. I have been eating some pizza lately, you know. I mean, not the healthiest stuff, but I don't eat much sugar. And I have been eating some chips, but you know, it's a moderation. Like, I haven't really set like a firm goal. Okay, I'm gonna get an eight pack in 90 days. It's kind of like more, you know, working out, you know, how it feels good. Get back in shape and, you know, like that I don't become this, oh, oh no, beast person. But since I got a gym membership for one week, which cost $20, I make sure to go there every day, you know. And this is how my gym membership looks like. You see right here. But this is how it looks like. And basically like this is how where it is, etc. So that's that. Another update is I got a new fan. And it's basically like a little Feel like this here you put in the USB and then it's like you just turn it on ah and you get some fresh air which is really great and in Florida it becomes really really hot here you know so yeah I hope you enjoy my video on an update on my life and I hope you enjoy some of the tips I could give you for my driving license and workout and how I feel Gosh, I feel so much less stress and it's like the past few days, I'm sorry if I couldn't up, I didn't operate. I was just so stressed, I had to focus, you know, I had to focus. But now, I feel more free, you understand? And fuck, I leave the 4th of July. That's gonna be hard for me. I really miss America, I don't wanna leave. Fuck. But anyway, um, I have to do this because I said I'd be this I can't disrespect them, I can't just leave. And tell the au pair family that I'm not coming, so I have to do that. I mean, it would be also fun, but I'm coming back here, like in the future, I promise. I promise. I prefer flight school, and probably I'll move here, so. I'm gonna tell you those plans 20 hours. in the future, okay? So I hope you enjoyed my video. Feel free to drop a like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends if you enjoyed, and peace out. Stay tuned for upcoming videos.